Welcome back and you're in the kitchen with Lynn. Today I'm going to show you how I make my healthy and extremely tasty bread. This bread has a soft or tender texture and the taste is very good with a delectable nutty flavor. The good thing about this bread is that it does not require any kneading. Let's get started. <music> Now I'm placing some flour into this bowl and do remember to check the description box. All right. I'm also adding some sugar. Add some salt. Here I'm adding some rolled oats and a mixture of whole grains. Here I'm adding the yeast and I'm going to combine this dry mixture well. Just give it a little stir making sure that everything is well combined. Once this is done, I'm going to add some butter. Here I'm going to also add some vegetable oil. Mix it, you will see some lumps but that's okay because once I use the yeast, I always do use warm water which is going to help to dissolve or melt down the fat into the dough. give it a good mix guys this make this bread does not require any kneading at all we're just gonna be mixing this bread i'm gonna mix it until the flour works in well the yeast and everybody just combines well and then i'm going to place a piece of cling wrap over this dough and leave it to rise at least for one hour or it all depends on the type of yeast that you use. You can leave it to rise until your dough doubles in size. And I did two sets of bread. I did some whole wheat also, but that's all right. This one here that I'm doing, it's the white flour. Okay, so I'll now set this aside and let it rise. After the dough has risen, here I'm going to give it a good mix again and then spray my pan with some vegetable oil and then place the mixture into this pan. making sure that I top it down with the wooden spoon so that the dough would be evenly spread in the pan. Cover it and leave it to rise again. After 25 minutes, I placed it in the oven of 350 degrees Fahrenheit and let it bake for 35 minutes. After 35 minutes, my bread is done. Golden brown, cripsy on top. Look at the rolled oats there. This bread is good, guys. Try it. Here I'm adding some butter over my bread just to give it a glaze. And remember, guys, we did not need this bread, okay? And this bread tends to have a darker bottom no matter what. But it's also still a nice, soft, textured bread. Look at how beautiful this is. Look at the grains in this bread. Guys, if you like this video, kindly please give it a thumbs up. Also, press that subscribe button. 
and also press the notification bell so that you will be notified when I upload another video. And yes, healthy is your choice and thank you for coming in the kitchen with Lynn. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.